Every year millions of animals are killed just for your accessories. It's brutal industry, but what if the strongest, softest leather would not require animal death at all? I'm talking about plant-based leather which is actually being used by brands like Armies, turning agricultural waste into solutions for cruelty. First there is this cactus leather. They are just cleaned, mashed into powder, sun-dried for 3 days and pressed into textile. This becomes soft and it even lasts longer than the real leather. So strong that you can even use them for your boxing gloves. But cactus you have to grow. So the next one comes from waste. It is banana stem leather. India produces 4 tons of banana waste for every 1 ton of fruit. A company called Benofi took this waste and turned this into leather bags. Real leather from banana stems. One bag that normally needs 10,000 liters of water to make, this one needs almost none. Now time for the weirdest source for the leather. It is mushroom leather grown from fungi mycelium in just 2 weeks using agricultural waste. It needs almost no water, no toxic chemicals and of course no animals. High end brands like Stella McCarty are already using it. But here is the craziest part. After you are done with this, it composts back into the soil in just 45 to 90 days and the leather disappears. So cool.